This award is presented to a cadet who demonstrates a high degree of loyalty to unit, school, and country, and exceptional potential for military leadership. This award is presented to Cadet First Lieutenant Alondra Perez. The next award is Military Officers Association of American Award. This MOA medal recognizes an outstanding cadet in their third year of JRTC who has demonstrated good academic standing, a high degree of loyalty, and has exceptional potential for military awards. This award is presented to Cadet Jabral Vanderhurst. The next two award is the United States Marine Corps Espied de Corps and the Scottish White Freemans. This award is presented to a distinguished cadet recognized as an ex experimental young citizen and a role model for other students and is recognized for having the best exhibited the traits of honor, courage, and commitment through leadership by example. And these two awards are presented to cadet Miazza McFarland. All right, before I move into my rifle stuff, um, the one thing I do want to talk about, these national awards that you just saw, the positive of these things, they come from outside organizations. These organizations, every single one of them actually has scholarships as well. So the positive of getting them is that it also opens a door to you to get the scholarship from these organizations come senior year. You should be applying to them for that scholarship as well, all right? That doesn't mean that you have to win the award from them to, to apply necessarily. It just means that you have to meet the criteria that they hold to win their awards to apply for their scholarships, okay? So, but winning their award does give you that next level in their competition to get those scholarships. All right, for rifle, yeah. rifle this uh, this class period, uh, Mr. Wicks is my uh, only person uh, this class period. He's uh, a returning shooter this year after Raider season. So uh, uh, we owe you your uh, expert rifle badge for some reason we're all of a sudden out of them but uh, your rifle uh, ribbon is waiting up here for you Next, we're going to move into uh, First Sergeant Dinkins' uh, leadership team. And uh, this next award goes to my favorite ghost cadet, um, Mr. Evans, who uh, 
was a member of uh, our uh, leadership team this last year, which once again placed and uh, very confident we would have continued to go to D.C. last year and been in the uh, final competition, which we've done. I'm talking about, no, getting up there and actually placing, okay? You know, I'm very proud of the fact that being the small little school, legit school that we are, that uh, out of 2,000 schools across the nation, we keep making it in that leadership competition, an academic level competition, being one of only 40 schools selected out of that 2,000 to go up there in that third and final round. That to me shows something about you all, all right? We are not being beaten out by all those special academia schools out there in California and everything. So, uh, very proud of y'all in that. And I think I just got to say to y'all, just keep up the good work. Come get your plaque, dude. This next one is uh, presented to our uh, the uh, armed male squad on the drill team, Cadet uh, Vanderhurst. <clears throat> Mr. Vanderhurst put a lot of hours into. Uh, perfecting his drill capabilities. He used to never know the difference between his left and his right foot. Now he gets it right about 50% of the time. See? All right, this is gonna take us into our unit awards. So uh, Mr. Booker, will you take over? For the first of our unit awards is going to be our SII Leadership Award. This is awarded annually to one cadet from each level who displays the highest level of leadership. And is presented to Cadet Alonja Perez. Our next award is our most athletic. Awarded to male, one male and one female winners of the Cadet Challenge Test. And is presented to first place, Miyaza McFarland. Our next award is Most Dependable. This is awarded to the most dependable male and female cadet. And is awarded to Cadet Wakes and Cadet Jude Cadet. Next award is our top first sergeant award. And is presented to Miyaza McFarland.
Now I'd like the company commander of Alpha to come up here and help me promote these fellow cadets. The senior Army instructor has reposed special trust and confidence in the patriotism, fidelity, and abilities of enlisted cadets. In view of these qualities and the cadets' demonstrated potential for increased responsibility, the cadet is therefore promoted to the cadet rank and assignment indicated. Cadet Sergeant Alexand Alexander Julian. Cadet Sergeant Parrish William. In addition to the promotion, they are also receiving their individual awards. <laughs> Cadet Sergeant Williams Jasmine. Cadet Staff Sergeant Wicks Matthew. <laughs> Cadet Second Lieutenant Cadet Jude. Cadet Captain McFarland. Yes. Cadet Force Sergeant Drew Paul. Cadet Second Lieutenant Morales Esther. And now for individual awards. As I call your name, please come forward and receive your awards. Vanderhorst. <laughs> Evans Cordes.